Welcome to this video for grade seven mathematics. And for this topic, we'll be looking at missing numbers on the number line. Now for the missing numbers on the number line, if you have a look at the example here, you'll see that on the number line, we have minus two moving to the left because it's negative. As we move to the left, it's minus. And then somehow we need to determine this missing value here on the number line. Now, what is the difference between 10 and two? Well, 10 minus two will give you eight. So from two going to 10 would give us minus eight. And if we do that again, moving to the left because it's negative. Now this space over here is minus eight. Now negative 10 plus minus eight would give us minus 18. And negative 18 plus minus eight would give us the missing answer of minus 26. Now in this next example, we have minus 11 and we're moving to the right on the number line, which means we are moving in the direction of positive. Now, what is the difference between 11 and five? Well, 11 minus five will give you six. Therefore, the spacing between minus 11 and minus five is positive six. Another way to look at it, a smaller gap over here, it means that six halfway would give us three. So moving to the right, because we are moving in a positive direction, to determine the unknown value. So let's have a look at this step by step. Minus 11 plus positive three would give us eight. So therefore from 11 plus three would give us minus eight. Moving one space next to the right, minus eight plus positive three would give us minus five. Now minus five plus three would give us minus two. And minus two plus three would give us positive one. Okay, we're almost there. Positive one plus three would give us our final answer of positive four. Thanks for watching this topic on missing numbers on the number line.